Hi, my name is Eli Ayala of Revealed Apologetics, and I'd like to welcome you to this series. We're gonna be doing presuppositional apologetics practically applied. We're gonna apply the presuppositional method to different worldview perspectives, how to navigate apologetic conversations, and how to apply presuppositional apologetics to atheism, Roman Catholicism, and the cult. Before we get into the meat of this series, which is gonna focus on how to apply presuppositional apologetics, in practical situations with specific worldview perspectives. Before we get there, I wanna talk a little bit about how to navigate those really sometimes difficult conversations. And hopefully I'll be able to equip you with some helpful tools in how to do that. We need to learn by the examples set by Jesus and the apostles. You see, when we read the gospels, we have an awesome picture of not only uh, the person and work of Jesus, but the many conversations and debates that he engaged in. Is Jesus God or was he sent by God? How would you answer that question? This is very important because the question is issued from a misunderstanding of what Christians believe about the Trinity and what they believe about the person and nature of Jesus. A lot of the objections and understandings of these cults and different religions are gonna come from a misunderstanding and you're not gonna be able to address those misunderstandings if you don't understand your own position. I hope that this is useful for folks and I'm happy to be here and hopefully uh, this is something that you can use in your day-to-day uh, -day apologetic interactions with others.